Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So in this video, we're gonna be going over one of my new favorite product research softwares for selling on Amazon. This is going to work great whether or not you're doing online arbitrage, retail arbitrage, wholesale, and especially dropshipping. The software is called Smart Scout Pro and it's made by Scott Needham, who is a top 100 Amazon seller inside of the US. His company is called Buyboxer and they internally use this software for their systems in order to find brands and products and they recently just made it available to the public. So Scott released this software about five months ago and since then I've been using it nonstop every single day to try and find new brands and to try and find different ways that I can use this software in my business. Now this video is mainly going to be focusing on the features of the software but in a future video I'm going to be showing you the use cases and how I implement it into my workflow for wholesale dropshipping. So be sure to go ahead and subscribe to the channel to stay notified for that video. Also in the description are links to my Facebook group and to my free wholesale dropshipping course. The first thing that we're going to look at is the pricing. Now this software does come out a little bit pricey. As you'll see, the monthly subscription is $97 a month. However, they have a really good deal when you sign up for the annual plan, which is just $497 a month. Trust me when I say that this software is worth every penny. There are a lot of softwares out there, but none of them have the features that Smart Scout has. The very first feature that you can check out without actually paying for it is they have a free feature on their site called Seller Map. This is a very freaky feature. In my opinion, it's kind of a little bit creepy because you can go ahead and you can see other sellers right at their location on a map. So the way that this works is you can go ahead and you can set certain parameters here. So let's say you wanna search for a certain seller, you would enter their name here. You can search for a certain category or you can go ahead and search through a certain monthly revenue. And you can also set the number of sellers that you wanna see. So let's say I wanted to see the top 200,000 sellers in North America, I would select this and then I would go ahead and press search. From there, I can zoom in on any portion of the map and I can actually see Amazon sellers at their location. So since I'm in New Jersey, let's go ahead and take a look at my home state. And if we zoom in on the map, you'll see that we can now start to see other Amazon sellers in that area. The way that this works is the more you zoom in, the more sellers you'll see in that given area. Now the sellers are represented by orange circles. The larger the circle, the larger the seller and the more monthly revenue they're doing. So this seller right here is doing $620,000 a month. And right here, this seller is only doing 119,000. Now where this feature really takes off is you can go ahead and click on any seller and it's going to give you all of their information. Now this software is importing the information from Amazon. So recently Amazon required all of their US sellers to have their business names displayed as well as their business address. So this software is pulling that information from Amazon and is now showing it to you on this map. What you can do with this data is you can go ahead and you can see their top brands that they're selling and how much monthly revenue each of those brands is bringing in. You can see where they're located what percentage of their products are FBA, as well as you can also get a direct link to their Amazon storefront. Now that's just one feature, and that's a feature that you can go ahead and test out completely for free. So let's actually log into the software so I can show you the bread and butter of SmartScout Pro. By the way, this is not a paid endorsement. I actually genuinely love this software, as you can tell. So when you log in, you're gonna have your dashboard. This is where you're going to see all of the new updates and features. Now, if you sign up at a later date, you're going to see different features than you have right now because they are constantly updating the software. The first category or the first feature that you have is going to be categories. This is a very basic feature, self-explanatory. What you can do is you can filter by different categories. So let's say I wanted to see baby products. I can then go ahead and I can search for brands in that category and I can find the top selling brands or I can find brands by any parameters. So let's say I wanted to find a brand, but I don't really care about the total number of products that they have. I wanna find a brand that has a monthly revenue between let's say 10,000 and maybe 100,000. So once I've entered in my search parameters, I'm then going to press search and Smart Scout is going to start finding those brands. So here we have all of the brands that are going to fit the criteria that I set. From there, Smart Scout is going to show me all of the results. I can sort the data any way I want. I can add filters, I can hide or show categories, and I can also export the data to an Excel file. You can also save different filters so that you can easily go back to it. So let's say I wanna go ahead and I wanna sort it by the highest monthly revenue. I would just click this and then it's going to line it all up. And from there, I can go to each brand and I can take a look at what they're doing. So obviously you'll see you have your Amazon in stock rate, the average number of sellers on those listings for that brand, and you have all the data right there. From there, I can go ahead and I can click right here and it's going to bring me up to the Amazon brand page. And also I can go ahead and take a look at this and it's going to show me the brand data. Once I have all of the listings pulled up from that brand, I can even go more in depth and I can find the sellers selling on that brand. I can go ahead and take a look at what other products those sellers are selling. And then it's kind of just like a cycle where you get to go ahead, find great products, find other sellers and find great brands that they are selling. 
So that's a very powerful feature, but that's not even the half of it. So let's go ahead and take a look at brands, which is kind of the same thing, but it's another way to go ahead and search through the data. So inside the brands tab, there's several things that you can do. If you have a specific brand in mind, you can always go ahead and enter it here. So let's say I wanted to go ahead and I wanted to find Sony products. I could enter it inside and then what it's going to do is it's going to find all of the brands that are either similar to that spelling, exactly like that spelling. So this can be a great feature if you're trying to find a brand's products on Amazon. Maybe you have certain sellers that created different listings. This is a great way to go ahead and find those brands listings. You can also go ahead and find brands by leaving that blank and you can input a category and the monthly revenue. However, that would also be done inside of the categories tab. Once you've found the brands that you're looking for, you can go through the different data. So you can go ahead and show the full brand info. This is going to show their listings, etc. Or you can go ahead and you can find the sellers selling on that brand, which is another way that you can go ahead and you can expedite your research because you can have all the information inside of Smart Scout, which is easily going to be able to go ahead and export into an Excel file. One cool thing that I really like about Smart Scout is that number one, it will show you the FBA percentage. So how often or how many listings is, is Amazon selling it as well as how many listings are FBA. And the other thing is brand percentage. So what this means is what percentage of this brand is this seller representing? So we see that Amazon is representing 41%. This seller is representing 10%. And this is some really good data that I personally have not seen in other softwares that lets me know if I can potentially sell a brand at a first glance. So continuing to the next tab, you have the products. This is where you can find specific products. So as you'll see, I can sort it by different categories. So let's say I wanted to look in appliances. I would just press search and then I can go ahead and I can filter by different categories or add certain filters. So let's say I wanted to find the top selling products inside of the appliance category. I would just go ahead and sort here by rank and it's going to show me the negatives ones first and then I can go ahead and I can set it to only show me one or below and then this way I can find the best selling products you can also go ahead and add certain parameters to maybe find products selling at a certain category or certain rank and this way you can go ahead and target those specific products so the next two features I'm going to skip for now they're relatively new but what you can do is you can enter in an ASIN or a keyword and smart scout will be able to tell you which variation is selling the most it can also show you where traffic is going where buyers are going from that product so very useful features, but personally, I don't really use it a lot in wholesale dropshipping. So the last feature we've already looked at, and that's the seller map, but the next feature is going to be sellers, which is another really good feature. So as you'll see, all of these different tabs kind of build off one another, but they all have different ways of finding the same information. So what I can do is I can find specific sellers. I can enter in their seller name. I can enter in their Amazon seller ID, or I can go ahead and find sellers selling in a specific category, or I can find sellers that are selling a certain monthly volume. So let's say I wanted to see all all the Amazon sellers that are doing between maybe 1 million and 100,000. So now I have all the sellers that are just selling between this range, which is 100,000 to a million. So it's a lot of different sellers, but from there I can filter the data to what I want. So let's say I'm trying to target sellers that are doing more FBM. I would try and bring down the range of FBA. So this way I can target sellers that are doing FBM and that these sellers have a higher chance of being drop shippers so I can target their products, see what brands they're selling and try and sell the exact same products. So that's a very quick overview of this software. There are a lot of great use cases for the software and personally, I've been using it a lot in my business. I think it's a very powerful tool and I wanted to make a quick video showing you some of the features. Like I said in the beginning, I'm going to be doing a dedicated video showing you different use cases, especially how you can use it in your wholesale dropshipping business. Also, don't forget to go ahead and join the Facebook group and also the free wholesale dropshipping mastery course. Links for those are down below. If you'd like to go ahead and test out Smart Scout Pro, you can use my affiliate link down below. I do get a small commission if you join through my link. With all of that said, I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.